nothing to prove, nothing to lose. Some in the blues, I'll weather the storm. Come on, bring me along, bring I'll bring me a charm. The sobolus never moves. Good morning. Here are your morning announcements for Wednesday, August 7th. I'm Tiaja Spikes. Welcome back to another great year of Dime. For those new students, welcome. To returning students, welcome back. It is going to be an exciting year with lots to look forward to. Here's Mr. Davenport. I want to thank you right off the bat. I want to thank you for, number one, coming back to Dime Community High School, one of the best high school here in the city by far. Uh, and I'm not just saying that, I'm saying this because it's facts, okay? That's what we're gonna live by, it's facts. And this is the best high school in the city, despite what people want to say, it is. Last year, we graduated 220 students. There's not a high school in this city that is putting up those type of numbers. I can tell you that now. Flex Fridays begins this year for the first time at Don. April McArthur has more details on Flex Fridays. Flex Fridays is a new option at Don Community High School. It is a way for students to get credit for going to school on Fridays without actually going to the school building. Students on Fridays will be given a choice of three things. They can either go to work, do community service, or do packets or APEX. There will be forms to fill out if they choose to do community service or work. They'll have a form that they have to take to their place of employment or to where they perform their community service and have it filled out and turn it back in on Monday. If they don't turn in their work on Monday, then they're marked absent for Friday. The only way you can make up Friday work if you miss it is if you have an excused absence for Thursday. Flex Friday is a good idea because it gives both the students and the teachers a little bit of a break from each other, but they're still getting some educational time in. It's important that Don Community High School students take this seriously because we are a pilot for this across the state. Schools are looking at us to see if this works for our students. Because if it works for our students, it can work for their students. So I'm asking Don Community High School students to take this seriously because we're an example being set across the state of Ohio and the city of Cincinnati. If we can get this right, your friends could have off Fridays too. This year, DCAP or the Don Community Arts Program kicks off. Hey guys, I'm Amari Vivi and I'm in the DCAP program, which is Don Community Arts Program. If you enjoy drawing, writing poetry, movie scripts, singing, rapping, and dancing, or playing instruments like I do, sign up now. For Tell a friend or a family member so we can all let our talents roar. You can learn to be a chef in our new culinary arts program. Chef Anthony Jordan will teach you everything you need to know to work in the culinary field. See your counselor to sign up. This year, the Kitmas program will be opening for all students who are pregnant or have children under the age of five. Daycare and parent training will be offered along with academic work. So now there's no need to drop out of school if you become pregnant. Yearbooks from last year are in their final stages of printing and should be available soon. Last spring's Wayne Woods picnic has become the back to school kickoff day. The picnic is next Thursday, August 15th. There will be food, games, and fun. Basketball, football, frisbee, and other fun activities. All students need to be at main campus by 9 a.m. to ride the bus to the park. Buses will drop students back off at main campus after the outing. Your Don Fighting Panther football squad has been practicing all summer. Their last scrimmage against Finneytown went well. There are practices and scrimmages to be played this month before the first game on August 30th in Ironton against Green High School. If you would like to be a part of this great team, meet Coach Ward and his coaches at the Fitness Academy for practice right after school at 3.30. We look forward to having a successful season. Don teachers and staff spent last week preparing for the school year, learning about school safety and CPR among other things. New staff members from all campuses were welcome to Don. Robert Smith and Jalobian Bokens are celebrating birthdays today. When you see them, wish them a happy birthday. For lunch today, we're having sloppy joe on a bun, coleslaw, hummus, peaches, a second food choice, and a choice of milk. Those are your announcements for today. Make a difference today, make someone smile, make it a great day at Don. <laughs>